Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. Now, this will be a very quick video because I still have some issues with my voice and I just can't record that long. But I still want to show you something that I think not that many people actually know, but that's actually very easy. So you can see I have an edit text here where I can enter my password and then simply toggle the visibility by clicking on this icon here. That is pretty cool for all kinds of password fields. And with material design, that is very easy to do, but many people don't know about that option. So let's actually jump into an empty Android Studio project um, and in activity main XML. This is actually the, the only file we really need to change here. We don't need to write anything in Kotlin here. I'm going to the code tab, the XML tab here, and I will switch this text view with a text input layout. So that is just a layout container basically for edit texts in material design that you should usually wrap around your edit texts. Um, this won't have a text of course because that is just the container so we can remove this. But what we can do is we can add a hint here, enter your password. And then we want to open that layout here open that tag and in here we will simply put a text uh, text oops text input add a text this one here um, give it a layout width of match parent and height as well and we actually want to set the input type of that edit text to password text password actually so that is just to make sure that the password won't actually show here and I will set EMS to 15. So that is just kind of to determine the width of that edit text. Then we can close that tag off. And if we now take a look in the design tab, you will see we have an edit text here, enter your password, but this toggle is missing. And to add that, that is very easy. We go back to the code tab to our layout and reset password toggle enabled to true. And that is all we need to do to actually enable that. Luckily that is built into uh, material design. So here you can see that icon is now en enabled and you also have some more options. So for example, the you can change the drawable of that, you can change the color of that. Um, so you have a bunch of options here, how you can customize your edit text. So that's it for this quick video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you're looking for more advanced courses, then check out the first link in this video's description. There you will get to my website and there you will also find premium courses. And with the discount code philip 15 you will get 15% off of all courses. So I wish you an awesome day and see you in the next video. Bye bye.